kind of competition, time is really, really important. It's the last minute left and I'm really nervous right now. I don't know how I'm going to finish this. It's too bookish. It's, it's a bit of textbook style dish for me. You should just worry this. मैं संजीव कपूर स्वागत करता हूं आप सभी का इन ओएसएस फूड शाला प्रेजेंटेड बाय फाइन नेशनलिटी कोई भी खाना ऐसी चीज है जो हम सबको आपस में जोड़ता है हमारा आज का एपिसोड भी कुछ ऐसा ही हमारी आज की पहली कंटेस्टेंट है साइमा खान जो दुबई से है और ट्रेडिशनल डिशेस को मॉडर्न अवतार देने में माहिर है हाय आई एम साइमा खान एंड आई एम बोर्न एंड ब्रॉट अप इन दुबई मेरी रूट्स दिल्ली से हैं, तो दिल्ली की गलियों का जायका मेरे खाने में महकता है ट्रेडिशनल खाने का मतलब ये नहीं है कि हम अपनी हेल्थ से कॉम्प्रोमाइज करें ट्रेडिशनल खाने का हेल्थियर वर्जन लेकर आ रही हूँ मैं सैमा खान फूडशाला सीजन नाइन में अब इनके साथ जुड़ेंगी आज रिहा बेन साइदा जो टूनिसिया से है टूनिसिया की डेट्स बड़ी बढ़िया होती है और ऑर्गेनिक फूड खाने में बिलीव करती है ऑल दी बेस्ट फॉर टूडेज कॉम्पिटिशन डू एल हाई माई नेम इज दिहाब आई एम फ्रॉम टूनिजिया आई बिलीव इन द क्वालिटी ऑफ द इंग्रीडियंट्स वन इंग्रीडियंट्स आर गुड फ्रेश एंड विद सम टच दिश विल बी डिलिशियस सो आई एम ब्रिंगिंग द पावर ऑफ सिंपल इंग्रीडियंट्स एंड हेल्थी कुकिंग द फूड शारा सीजन नाइन Saima Rihab welcome to the kitchens of food shala thank you sir thank you sir Saima how do you feel today sir it's an honor to be standing in front of you it's a pleasure to be on the show i'm sure you're going to prove your culinary skills today thank you sir Rihab yes sir all the way from tunisia yes all right so let's begin today's episode but before that i would like to tell you something never have i ever tasted grass Never have I ever dipped fries in my milkshake, and never have I ever tasted raw chicken. And that's exactly what your today's theme is. आपको बनानी है एक ऐसी dish जो मैंने कभी पहले खाई ना हो, ना सुनी हो, ना देखी हो. I was really surprised. It's something new. कुछ नहीं सुना कभी इसके बारे में. अब आप मुझे बोलो पचास लोगों के लिए खाना बना के रख दो मैं आपके सामने रख दूंगी वट इज दिस एंड टूडेस्टेंट एन एडवांटेज वो एडवांटेज क्या होगा आपको बताऊंगा अब से थोड़ी सी देर में आपकी आज की टास्क है कैरमल पोल्ड आम So caramelized pulled almond is something fancy that we see on those yummy desserts. Aap log hilate kahan se ho ye task kaun sochta hai? Using the sugar is not something easy. Almonds ke sath caramel aur wo bhi usko shape karna wo too much. Is task ko pura karne ke liye aapko diye jayenge pure 10 minutes. I am going to judge this task on two parameters. First, the color of the caramel. Second, how long are your caramel pulled almonds? हमारे इस फूड शाला के किचन में हाइजीन इज पैरामाउंट एंड दैट्स द रीजन वी हैव केप्ट अ फाइन स्टेरलाइज्ड बॉक्स ऑन योर स्टेशन फूड शाला के किचन में बहुत कुछ नया था लेकिन एक चीज फेमिलियर थी जो कि फाइन का किचन टेबल था इसमें वो सारे एसेंशियल्स हैं व्हिच आर रिक्वायर्ड फॉर यू टू स्टे सेफ इन दिस किचन लाइक स्टेरलाइज्ड किचन टेबल्स फेस मास्क ग्लव्स यूज देम एज एंड व्हेन रिक्वायर्ड फाइन किचन टेबल्स फैमिली हाइजीन इंस्टीट्यूट से रेकमेंडेड है And that was something new for me. Or, meri kitchen mein to entry hi nahi hai bina haath dhoye. So time to wash your hand, ladies. Go. Home chef se jo chef ka safar hai, wo bahut challenging hone wala hai. अभी तक मैं बहुत लेजरली खाना बनाती आई हूँ मैंने इस प्रेशर में कभी काम नहीं किया 
सो इट वॉज ऑल न्यू एंड थोड़ा सा पानी क्रिएट हो गया था बिकॉज मेरा कैरमल जलने वाला था Okay, we have you need to focus on these two objectives like the col- color of the caramel need to be nice and at the same time I was thinking of the love. I was always mixing 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 because unless like uh, can burn as I told you like working with caramel is not something easy like it's really we need to be careful careful careful. And time up. Okay. Saima. Yes, sir. Let's chef. check your almonds. This one's too small to be measured. Okay, let's see if this one can come back to life. No. Ye nahi hoga. Ha, ye wala ho sakta hai. Let's measure this one. When I was working, I didn't see what she was doing. So, I was like, wow, she made a lot of caramelized uh, full almonds and like I was really excited about the height, like how it, uh, how long it will be, like is it more than mine? Is it less than mine? I was thinking that it will not matter its thinness because it will not stand. I made my own job, it was stable and it was the length stand. 10, 9, 8. Very good color, perfect caramel. Congratulations! Wow, that's long. So, like, ah. Rehab. Yes, chef. Let's check what's the length of your caramel almonds. Okay. Let's check. Oh, this one's really delicate, and uh, this is over 12 inches. So this one's actually longer than my scale. Very good. Perfect. Thank you, Chef. And the color, color is again good. Very nice. Very good. Wow, how you made it! Like it exceeded the line, like the ruler. Like I was wow. Rehab, your caramel pulled almonds actually crossed the length of my scale, and that's why you have won the task. Wait. Rehab, I'm giving you two options to choose your advantage. Option number one, you can quarantine Sahima for ten minutes, which means that she cannot work; she can only stare at you. Option number two, you can steal any one garnish from her tray. One second, I wish I had known that Rehab, please, option two, just let me. This is something like. Breathe, Rehab. You have this. Like it's like green card in my hands. Rehab. Yeah. Which option would you like to choose? Ten minutes quarantine. Ten minutes quarantine. In these kind of competitions, time is really, really important. जिसका डर था वही हुआ. उसने option one choose कर लिया. And I wasn't expecting that. She is very smart. She knows exactly what to do. Sweet दिखती है, but smart. So Saima, be very cautious because. Today both of you have to make a dish which I would have never tasted earlier I would have never imagined or seen All set Yes chef Great so let's begin today's challenge never have I ever surprise me So let's begin today's challenge. Never have I ever surprise me. I started uh, cooking my main dish uh, with a clear mind. This is actually a disadvantage for me because I'm losing time and every minute matters. टोटल टाइम में से दस मिनट कम है मैं उसको इस तरह से सेव कर सकती हूँ कि मैं जो टफ टास्क है वो पहले करती हूँ जैसे कि मेरे बिरयानी के राइस बॉईल करना और उसका मसाला तैयार करना द सैलड्स एंड द अदर सॉसेस आई कैन प्रिपेयर लेटर सो दैट्स हाउ आई एम थिंकिंग टू यूटिलाइज माई टाइम आई एम कॉन्फिडेंट इनफ दैट आई विल फिनिश एवरी थिंग इन टाइम एंड द शेफ विल लव इट यू कैन स्टार्ट कुकिंग नाउ
When we cook, we need to be organized and we need to know what we, we need to have like a map, what we're going to do. So I had this in my mind and I was working conf with confidence. पहला दिन था फूडशाला के किचन में तो नर्वसनेस तो बनती है क्योंकि कभी इस किचन में काम नहीं किया कभी इतने लोगों के बीच काम नहीं किया अपने कंफर्ट जोन से बाहर आके आई वॉन्ट टू कलर माइक्रोस्कोस यूज इन बीच रूट एंड हिबिस्कस सो आई वॉज वॉरी द कलर वुल नॉट बी एंड एज आई वॉन्ट दिस then later for the presentation it will be pale main panic mein aa gayi thi seeing dusra contestant mujhse bahut aage nikal chuka hai uske kafi saare tasks ho chuke hain pre preps ho chuki hain okay saima yes sir i am running yes sir what are you making here sir this is a miso eggplant miso eggplant okay This will be served with my pulao as vegan ka bharta that we call it in India but um I'm making a Japanese version of it Japanese version of vegan ka bharta Japanese would be very happy Yes Mujhe pata tha ki meri dish sunke chef zarur impress ho jayenge Saima Yes chef I see that you are whisking the dough with chopsticks Yes chef That's the way Japanese people do That's the traditional way of whisking it because if we whisk it too hard the batter won't be fluffy enough for the tempura so to keep wow. the batter airy we need to not mix it too hard and just a gentle mix is fine and i will be using sparkling water so that the batter is more fluffy very good impressive all the best thank you chef bahut acha laga sunke ki ek chef baat kar rahe hain mujhse kyunki we are home chefs aur hum aari koi aisi tareef kare to bahut acha lagta hai rehab yes chef wow look at your workstation so clean and well organized thank you so much that's a trait of a good chef you must ensure that's always organized nice clean spick and span that's the only way you can make good dish i'm really happy and really excited and i imagine if my mom was looking at me she was really proud because this is what she told me <laughs> what are you trying to make there in that beautiful pan so i'm uh, trying to make a vanilla pudding Okay. With a twist, not the casual vanilla pudding, because we know that the casual vanilla pudding is made with egg yolk, so uh, and with sugar, obviously. So here I'm making it without egg and without added sugar. So when you make vanilla pudding or any pudding for that matter using egg yolks, which means sabayon or zabaglion, yeah, that's when you get the binding and the consistency in your pudding. Are you sure you'll be able to get that? Sure, because here I'm using the corn flour. So no sabayon, no zabaglion. Yeah. My expectations from you are very high. I want a perfect texture. Inshallah. I have this opportunity. I want to share my passion. I want to show what I know and what I can do and the 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 twisted dish that I can create. You added egg in this? No, the egg. Oh, cinnamon. I, yes, I wanted the texture. Yeah, it's with cinnamon. You need to play more with flavors. Okay. And it needs a bit more of probably all about hurry up guys saima ke pan mein ek problem hai wo dish sahi nahi banegi agar wo theek nahi karenge and at the same time rehab is very confident but i'm really looking forward to taste this custard i'm really excited and can't wait to prepare my dish as i'm imagine it and to to present it to the chef and uh, hope it will be nice and he will love it jab chef ne kuch nahi bola fish nu pakad ke to meri jaan nikal gayi kuch bhi nahi bola and main panic kar gayi ki kuch galat hai ye tempura bahut bura banne wala hai क्योंकि एक तो उसका टेम्परेचर सही नहीं है और दूसरा देखिए कोटिंग आर पार फाइव मिनट्स टू गो इतना प्रेशर इतना कुछ करने को है इतनी चीजें एक साथ चल रही हैं कैसे बना लेते हैं लोग इतने प्रेशर में खाना 
So I was plate in my dish while she was cooking. So I think the disadvantage that I gave her landed her in trouble. It's the last minute left and I'm really nervous right now. I don't know how I'm gonna finish this. I'm trying my best. Okay, okay, I'm almost uh, there. I'm just uh, finishing the last step, so inshallah I'll be on time. We have Saima, stop cooking now. Welcome back to Oasis Food Shala presented by Fine. And here both the contestants are trying to make a dish which they think I would have never tasted before. Saima? Yes, Chef. Present your dish to me. Saima? Yes, Chef. Never have I ever seen a dish like this? Yes, Chef. But I have seen many dishes like this. The combination of Indian and Japanese cuisine is not very common. So you will find many different flavors in the dish that I have created today. The whole point of today's theme was that you had to make one dish, which I would have never tasted earlier. Um, I don't know why the chef didn't like the combination. Let's start. All right, let's start this. First things first. Yes, sure. The main point of today's episode was sticking to the theme, which was never have I ever. And you have nailed it. Jab chef ne bola ki I nailed it, to mera hawai jahaz jo hai wo aasman mein uda. Completely wrong. Bura laga tha of course, kyunki mai bilkul hi opposite Expect karithi. I was thinking, Rehab, this is your opportunity. Like this is the your advantage, and inshallah you will win. Aberdeens with miso. Aberdeens are beautifully cooked, but the miso has burnt out. Too much of sesame on the aberdeens is making this dish taste even more bitter. This tempura was cooked on a shallow flame. It's not seasoned well. The choice of fish is not good, and it's not crispy at all. You should just bury this. Tempura needs to be crunchy, like ah. Many um, tempura bahut baar banaya hai, and every time I make it, it's a very big hit in my family. The fish that you used was not the right fish because that fish you used basa. I uh, know. Um, I used cod. You used cod? Yeah. But then this is not the way you make cod. Fried cod tastes so good. You disintegrated the properties of an exclusive cod fish and made it taste like just cream dory. Actually, choice of fish um, was fine, but the method I prepared it was wrong. What went wrong? You didn't absorb the water from the fish. Um, yes, chef. Um, um, because I lost ten minutes in the beginning, I was a bit panicked, so I um, skipped that part and I added the fish to the but tempura. That's the basis to a good fish tempura. You need to absorb the water. If the water content in the main ingredient, which is with batter fried, is high, you will never have a crisp tempura. Never have I ever heard about this. Today, because of pressure, I think I got lucky. I was like, ah, oh, sorry for her, but this is a chance for me. Rice can be cooked with various methods: pilaf, absorption, steaming, boiling, pot sealing. You used pilaf method of cooking rice. And you excelled in that technique. Very nicely cooked rice. Every grain can be separated from this pilaf. Thank you, Chef. Hats off. Thank you. इतनी सब गरबर के बाद जब सुना कि साइमा राइस बहुत अच्छे बने हैं, तो मैंने कहा, 
वेल डन सायमा कुछ तो अच्छा किया मूव ऑन टू द सॉस दिस सॉस कैन बी अ प्रोप्राइटरी सॉस यू नो व्हाट इज द प्रोप्राइटरी सॉस द वन व्हिच यू इन्वेंट पेटेंट एंड द वर्ल्ड कॉल्स इट बाय योर नेम यस द सॉस इज जस्ट बैंग ऑन थैंक यू शेफ um kaise hoti hai patent main patent kara leti hu aap help karo na let's see what reha has to show us now reha bring your dish to me please reha let me tell you something your plate doesn't look to me like something that i would have never ever seen earlier I was like, oh, Rehab! Like it starts to be tough here. पहले presentation में जब chef ने बोला कि cross, तो I was like, कुछ कोप है. Okay, chef, but the ingredients and the the combination that I made, it's something that you have ever, never, ever tried. Bang on! That's the second part of today's theme. The taste of your dish can be such which I would have never experienced earlier. You know when I look at this dish it actually makes me feel that this is made by a machine. Everything is just so perfect, very technical. The layers of couscous chicken, couscous chicken, nuts, sauce, it is just equal. Wow, I made it. The presentation and the layers that I wanted to create, I made it. Um jab chef ne bola ki layering kafi achhi thi to mera wo cross right mein convert ho raha tha. I hope the taste is also equally good. First of all, I would like to rename this dish. I would call it probably a mifi or a tia of chicken and couscous with some nuts and a nice aromatic vanilla pod caramel sauce on the side. Yeah. Secondly, it is very difficult to balance the flavors when all the things, all the ingredients on your plate are sweet. The way you use cassia bud instead of cinnamon added a beautiful aroma to the chicken. and raisins complementing with the chicken the overall texture of the chicken is to die for thank you so much chef very nicely executed thank you nay but mujhe meethe aur namkeen ka combination thoda odd laga moving on to the couscous this is the full stop of couscous cooking no one can cook couscous better than this thank you chef wow i was so so happy aap jab apne opponent ki tareef sunte ho तो ऑटोमेटिकली दिल में कुछ होता है ओवरऑल इट्स अ ब्रिलियंट प्लेट बट आई थिंक सम एक्स फैक्टर्स यू नो दोस फाइनल टच इज ऑफ अ शेफ आर मिसिंग हियर इट्स टू बुकेश इट्स इट्स अ बिट ऑफ टेक्स बुक स्टाइल डिश फॉर मी ऑल द बेस्ट हाँ टेस्टिंग हो चुकी है जो होना था हो गया अभी फिंगर्स क्रॉस्ड है एंड रिजल्ट का वेट होगा फॉर मी आई एम रियली हैप्पी विद बट आई वॉट अ गेम दिस हैज बीन What a game! On one hand, we had Saima, who was trying to fuse flavors of India with the Japanese cuisine, and on the other hand, we had Rihab, who was trying to experiment with the traditional dish and giving it all together a new avatar. But there has to be one winner, and the contestant who is going to the quarterfinals of Food Challenge Season Nine is. Saima you're going home Rehab So all I can tell you guys is that never have I ever had so much fun here and I hope you guys too enjoyed today's episode this is Akshay Nayar and I'm going to see you next week Gay Company Production